Hey everyone, James Reeves, TFB TV SHOT Show 2023 at one of my favorite booths, Dat Spiritusi, Spiritus Systems. You guys know I'm just a LARPer, however, they do make one of my most favorite fanny packs in the entire world. So respect the company, respect what they do. It's always a great product, and you guys are always interested, and that's what's most important, of course. So I'm here with my buddy Chris. You guys recognize him from prior years. Chris is going to give us the rundown of the new-ish from the Spiritists. Let's go. Awesome. All right. So uh, for this year, we're focusing a little bit more on specialized equipment. So not as many new plate carrier accessories, not as much uh, Rhodesian-style mini chest rigs. What's old has become new again, and what we have here is a full multicam Tropic 34 Alpha split chest rig LBV loadout. Um, these are our spud pouches. Uh, we've got some GP talls on here, which is like our general purpose pouch, and it's all mounted to our 34 Alpha split chest rig chassis system, which is essentially two molly panels that you can throw whatever you want on there and then the new component because these have been kind of out for a hot minute is the backside. so we're going to go take a look at the the rear end here that's what everybody says about me <laughs> is the hot part right that's where all the action is yes sir this is our new butt pack uh module that you can clip into the back so it fully changes you know what you're able to carry you can slap on our 32 ounce nalgene bottle components on each side we have a roll top component in the back for extra socks, uh, copious amounts of snacks. Uh, it's not waterproof, so if you're actually using this in the jungle, we recommend adding in a waterproof like liner bag. Um, because I was gonna ask, yeah, I mean, my yeah. jungle use is pretty extensive. I know you're out there a lot. I am. Um, if you're going on hikes in you know, Maui or something, <laughs> put a ziplock <laughs> in for that. Uh, it's got a front pack zipper, and then it also has an X harness, which is integrated into it to allow you to carry a little bit more weight. So this is coming out um, in the near future. We don't have a hard release date for it yet, but if you already have a 34 Alpha split chest rig, this is going to give you a lot of extra storage space. It was designed for individuals who don't have a lot of support logistically. Um, if you get dropped off somewhere hot and uh, humid and you need some extra supplies, this will definitely get you there. And if you need to then move to a vehicle or move somewhere else, you can unclip this, put on a regular, uh, you know, back panel strap uh, or back strap, kind of similar to the ones you use on your bank robber. Right. Same thing. It's all compatible. And it, uh, it you know, it's not uncomfortable to sit in a vehicle or something like that. So. See, with the MC Tropic, man, I mean, I don't know. I guess you guys have named this, but I mean, for me, and you can borrow this royalty free mostly, the FMP, the, the, the Florida man pack <laughs> is what <laughs> I would call Florida it, the FMP, pack. because this is... Florida man camo That's right good, here, good. and yeah, and you need the hydration. It's great, a lot of meth and beef jerky in there too. <laughs> beef jerky, and uh, well, we're going to be making a specific uh, Kydex insert for Virginia Slims or whatever else they smoke. I don't <laughs> yeah, know. yeah, that's, that's Newport's uh, actually. Newport, sorry. yeah, that's right. I wouldn't know, but yeah. So um, let's. Uh, we've got some more civilian yeah. applicable yeah, items yeah, yeah, here, yeah. right? Yeah. I'll pull this down. We'll go to the table. So a lot of our stuff is really specialized, but that doesn't mean that people don't find alternative uses for it, you know? And I think if something's built really well and built with a lot of cool little, you know, widgets and, and different things, you can find other uses for it. And that's probably what'll be happening here. This is our Delta bag. Um, and it was designed for uh, special forces medics. So it's an assault medic bag with a Velcro field that holds a ton of stuff that most people will not need. Yeah, it's an entire ambulance in that sub. Yeah, of exactly. Bit. So, so this is what the intended use case is. Now, since this is TFB TV. That sounded condescending, actually. Chris. No, no, I'm just saying, if you don't have saline solution, an MP5K will fit in here. Um, we've got all types of other cool things that'll fit in here. Uh, it's all loop line, so if you have any type of other sub pockets, um, we make uh, Velcro backed organizers. Basically, you know, this thing is a blank canvas for anything you want to store in here. It opens up. Um, I've got people who I know are already using it for their iPads, you know, so hey, they're. That's that's totally viable. Sure. And uh, uh, it's a small footprint. So. Yeah, and show me the, uh, I mean, we have just three pockets up front. Yeah, it's so these are three pockets. Um, they won't ship with bubble wrap, but 
we'll just show you the inside. So they're all identical. They have Velcro on the inside. They're mesh lined, and the candy cane configuration is actually uh, on purpose. Um, it lets you get into the whole pocket super easy, so you can maximize your storage. But also, if you leave it uh, unzipped and you move it around, it's not just going to yard sale all your junk, right? right? It'll, it'll, the diagonal configuration forces it to kind of return to a semi-closed position. So again, um, your meth and beef jerky will right, not fall right. out. You so. see it very critical. I hope you guys make this in multi-cam tropics Perfect. so I can use we do. this. Yeah, it's up there. Yeah, I'll get you one. Florida, the panhandle. Yep, and it ships with backpack straps, um, and those can be mounted on these guys right here. Comes with two secret pockets for uh, whatever you want to be hidden. Not cash, again, Not you know, cash. Florida man, I mean, maybe food stamps. <laughs> Not cash, exactly, food stamps. Um, yeah, and that's it. And the, this is our uh, first really like independent pack offering. And um, I think it'll do super well. It's small, compact, and it'll retail for uh, $279.95. I, this actually is really cool. This yeah. was a lot more than I expected looking at it. But again, everything you guys do is really well thought out. Let's go ahead and finish up the Florida Man hat trick with the new fanny pack. All right, so this is not new, but we love it. So we'll talk about it again. This is our uh, fanny sack. Sub-abdominal carry kit. Sub-abdominal carry kit. The acronym is completely coincidental and non-intentional. Sure. But hey, it is what it is. Uh, Velcro lined on both sides on the inside with a front pocket. It's square, it's small, it's functional, and we love it. Can we do the new one, like the new new? We could. Let's do, do it. Do yeah, it? Hell yeah. So we have the OG. I literally, you guys have seen this in my TFB TV videos all, because I use this one all the time. It's one of my favorites, but now you guys are, are upsizing a little bit because. Yeah. And I actually don't know what the official name for this is gonna be. It, it might be the Fanny Sack Max. It might be the Jumbo Sack, I'm not sure. <laughs> but it fits bigger guns. Essentially, we've had a lot of dudes who have adopted the original Fanny Sack for concealed carry. Um, there's one right here, I think, right? Yeah, yeah, exactly. I think you, you kind of into that. I'm not sure. No, no, uh, yeah, obviously. Yeah, we right? don't. Yeah, yeah. Uh -huh. but, uh, but it fits bigger guns. It, it's as simple as that. And the form factor is a little bit different to kind of keep it slim moving down so you're not just lugging a bunch of extra stuff. Same exact pocket configuration, but uh, a lot of the guys at the office are super into, like, staccatos and just different larger guns with uh, form factors that are bulkier. And uh, so when you don't have something that fits, you make something that fits that. What's wrong with you people, you know? I mean, just get a Glock, right? Yeah. Call it a day, and, you know, but, but here we are. Now Spiritus now has are. to accommodate you people. Uh, <laughs> this accommodation, the accommodation pack. It is, dude. When, <laughs> when is, is this going to release? Yeah, in fact, you know, you guys can yeah. use that royalty free. Yeah, uh, I'm going to pull a, a Q1, Q2 standard SHOT Show Got answer. It. Yeah, so uh, total bullshit. Got it. <laughs> but Check. this... But this is still here. So, um, it, you know, again, if it's not broke, we're not going to fix it. We're just adding to the to the, the lineup. So, Price on this one. Did you mention it already? No, I did not. Okay. Let's hear it. It's it, never too late. It, it might not be mentionable yet. We'll see. Got it. Also, okay. the standard shot show thing. I think people have gotten better about that. Um, we're, we haven't. <laughs> right. Okay. So. It's, yeah. Yeah. It's TBD. So, okay. Yeah. All right. Got it. Well, yeah. I'm going to go ahead and take some of those IV pouches for my yeah. hangover tomorrow. Sounds good. Thank you so much, Thank Chris, you, as usual. Oh, come on. You know, I love seeing you guys. Guys, stay you. tuned. I love seeing you all the time on TFB TV. Stay tuned for more SHOT Show 2023. <laughs>